Good morning, and welcome to another episode of Growth Search. I am Pastor Alicia Allen, and today the topic is check your position. How far are you from God? How close are you to God? Are you on fig trees hiding? Or are you by the burning bush having a conversation? Adam and Eve daily were close to God. They had conversations and were intimately involved. But when they yielded to sin, they tried to cover and hide themselves from God. A God that is everywhere and sees everything. They allowed the sly, deceptive serpent to steal their freedom. Sin caused a position shift in their lives and it's still the same today. God and sin can't reside together in the same being. You can't be for God and for the enemy too. Choose whom you will serve and stop fooling yourself. A story is told of a man who went to heaven and met St. Peter. And they were walking through a building and he saw his name on a door and he asked if he could open it. Peter asked him if he was sure and he said yes. So Peter told him, go ahead. And inside were shelves of boxes. He asked Peter, what was inside? Peter asked, you really want to know? And the man said, yes. Peter told him, those are blessings. God wanted to send your way, but you were on the wrong street. How many of us miss out on blessings because God wants to send them to us in one place and we're someplace else? Peter told the man, you missed out because you did not ask. You did not believe you could have it. You doubted God. You felt you were not worthy. All these are positions out of alignment with a God who tells us, ask and we shall receive. He will never withhold anything good from us once it is in accordance with his will. Don't let sin hinder your blessings. From the time you move from Faith Street and you allow the enemy to speak to you and deceive you into going on sinful drive, you will hit a dead end and miss out on blessings. Today, I want to tell you, God sends your blessings on Faith Street. Have faith, trust God, drive out of doubtful alley, ask not heights and not worthy way. Position yourself on Faith Street your blessings will come to you on Faith Street. Let us pray. Father, bring us back to Faith Street. Help us, Lord, to have faith in you, to ask of you, to trust in you, Father God, so that you can receive the honor and the glory and the praise in Jesus' name. Amen. So what's your position? I hope it's on Faith Street.